The owner of Tiny Tykes Daycare in Trenton, Betsy Grant, is scrambling to make ends meet after claiming the state failed to keep up with payments for foster children in her care. It's because I'm not getting paid on time that it's actually compromising the care that I can give. I can't spend the time doing the charitable things that we do if I can't pay for oil and food and pay the staff. Grant says she never received more than $10,000 from the state for 14 foster children in her system over the span of six months. She says the daycare faced a potential closure in 2021 as well due to similar circumstances. I keep being told if you only took a certain percent, you wouldn't be going out of business because it wouldn't be so impactful. But I don't want to do that. I will take any foster child that needs me. That's our job. According to the Department of Health and Human Services, Grant was paid through the Child Care Subsidy Program on a regular basis. The department says they recently became aware of a week in March where the provider was not paid due to what they say was a clerical error. One week in March did not annihilate a business. Jackie Farwell, a spokesperson with the DHHS, said in a statement, for child care paid through other arrangements, the department has actively communicated with the provider in the last month to ensure any concerns regarding billing and payments were researched and addressed. Grant says although she finally received payments at the end of October, she now has to work to rebuild her business and reputation. She says the future of the daycare is unclear. I hope to see child care looked at as not even essential as crucial to people being able to survive. In Trenton, Grace Blanchard for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.